In South Sudan, the UN Refugee Agency, UNHCR, has reported that more than 100,000 people in the southwestern part of the country, in Ye, are cut off from the rest of the country due to armed conflict there. CCTV's Patrick Oyet has more from Juba. UNHCR has said the more than 100,000 people in Ye are in desperate need of basic goods and services such as shelter, mosquito nets, food and medicines. Most of the people ran away from the nearby villages due to insecurity and are sheltering in church compounds. They are trapped in the town with roads leading to and out of Ye closed Telecommunication networks have also been cut off in the town which borders Uganda and Democratic Republic of Congo. Ye had remained peaceful during the South Sudan's conflict of 2013 to 2015. But since the July 2016 clashes between forces loyal to former first vice president Riek Machar and those of President Salva Kiir, the people of Ye have witnessed increase in violence. The UNHCR report quotes some civilians who accuse South Sudan army of committing offenses in the area. But the government military spokesperson, Brigadier General Lul Roy Kong, denied any wrongdoing by the army in the area. He says the army leadership has now set up a court martial and any of its officers who will be found to have committed offense anywhere in the country, including in Ye, will face the law. Lul says the army is also working to build a good relationship with the civil population. Patrick Oyet, CCTV, Juba, South Sudan.